For the last 50 years, we've been very successful in wine wholesaling. What makes you think you'd be successful as a member of the team? Mr Jones, we both know it's the quality of your wines that'll make me a success in this position. Well now, Rog, can you describe what selling techniques you would use in introducing, say, a Taylor's 2002 Merlot? Well, first I'd point out the colour. Then I'd talk about the bouquet and the softness. Then I'd open a bottle and I'd give the customer a taste. And after a few more drinks, he'd be sold on it. Well, that's good. Is there anything more you'd like to know about the position? Are you able to give me an indication at this stage as to the likelihood of me being offered this position? Well, I can safely say that of all the candidates I have interviewed, I like your manner and I like your experience. But there is one thing that bothers me. I am concerned at your mannerism of winking. I'm afraid it might put some of our customers off. Well, I understand what you're saying, Mr Jones, but I do have a way of controlling it. Oh, you do? What's that? It's simple. All I have to do to get rid of it is to take a couple of aspirin. Look, I'll show you how it works. I've got some here somewhere. They're here somewhere. Ah, here they are. There. Look at that. It's stopped. Yes, that's all very fine. But we're a very conservative company. And we wouldn't consider hiring a salesman who's going to be womanising all round the country. Mr Jones, I'm not into anything like that. Well, Rog, how do you explain all these? Ah, that's easy. Have you ever tried walking into a chemist's shop, winking at the sales girl, and asking for a packet of aspirin? <laughs>